Welcome back to Twitter TD Twisters, now partnered with OnlyFans. It's me, yours truly, the Kevin Pereira of Cans, and I am delighted to, uh, today because we're covering uh, Nora at Nora Fawn over on X, formerly Twitter. Folks, be sure to subscribe to her OnlyFans. OnlyFans, proud par uh, sponsor of Twitter Titty Twisters. Uh, her site is OnlyFans.com slash Nora Fawn. And I, I, I'm excited here. Normally in these videos, I, I try to focus just on the jugs. But I think this one warrants uh, a full exploration of the the full outfit itself as it uh, pertains to the jugs. Uh, because Nora here is dolled up as 2B. One of the main protagonists from one of my favorite video games, Near Automata. Uh, and this appears to be a variant outfit not featured in the game, but I like to imagine this outfit is something that 2B would buy during the trip to a shopping mall that her and her sidekick 9S fantasize about early in the game. Now, <clears throat> Near Automata is a game with a, a story about the war between androids and robots uh, in, in a far future in, in which the human race no longer exists and the androids and, and robots have been warring with each other for many, many years with neither one realizing that they are essentially the same thing. Machines originally constructed by the now long extinct human race. The only major difference between the androids and robots being that the androids are more human in appearance, whereas the robots resemble more industrial <coughs> machinery. Uh, the game kind of serves as a metaphor for how the uh, human race now and in our history and now uh, goes to war with, the, uh, you know, humans go to war with each other, causing immense the death and suffering. And it seems to be this endless cycle uh, of, uh, of that, despite all of us, you know, kind of being the same. Uh, though we may have our differences, we're all one in the same. And harmony and progress are, are, are ours if we can reconcile our differences and lay down arms. And on a broader philosophical level, uh, the game Near Automata is an exploration into what it means to even be human. Uh, e even in the absence of that which makes us what we think makes us human our flesh and blood and bone and muscle and nerve endings uh in the absence of all that in a purely synthetic world does humanity still exist does, does the essence of humanity of consciousness uh still uh thrive you know and though to be uh, the the one of the protagonists in the game, as we see here with Nora, is an anime style Android video game character. Um, as I played the game, I was constantly trying to get a better look at her titties. And while the black dress she wears in the game is sexy, it is almost uh, you know it's it's very modest, almost nun like, monastic. Uh, so the way the jugs are presented here by Nora finally grant me access to that which was concealed in the game. Two Bs, two boobies. And Nora here, uh, I'm, I'm grateful for this as well, has achieved the uh, a pale complexion similar to that of a cold, synthetic, unfeeling, militaristic android. Uh, which is very attractive to me. You know, I love them pale. I love a good pair of palins. 
Uh, and I love it when uh, the woman to, to which they are attached is cold and distant, uh, you know. So, you know, to, to put it in human terms, you know, I'm talking about an android, but a human woman, as I'm describing, would be uh, one with BPD. Um, now, these are ample uh, jugs, not slobber knockers, but not petite perkies. A, a couple of nice handfuls, modest enough for the virginal 9S to be sidekick but still big enough for 9S to break free of his programming and develop true feelings for 2B. And it is uh, it, through his love of 2B that he continues to put his own life on the line and save her and, and, and show for her his undying loyalty that she then is able to break free of her programming and develop feelings going against the uh, militaristic programming that is, in, you know, installed in the warrior class androids like 2B and 9S. Uh, so uh, 10 out of 10 wood motorboat. 